Good morning from Arrested Valeria. I feel good. I feel good. Today we are doing lots. First of all, I am still in this gorgeous, gorgeous suite at La Maurice. I'm here with Valmont and they're hosting me and I'm so excited. Today it's going to be a bit of a come to work with me day because I'm here to shoot some content with Valmont and to learn more about the brand and experience it. I first discovered the products through my facial lady. I love them. She gave me like small little samples to try out because she was putting it on my skin every time I would go for treatment. And when they called, I was like, Sounds familiar, sounds like something I like. Lo and behold, they called and I'm here. Just got our coffee and croissants. It's funny because when we first arrived, someone was like, how do you eat croissants every day? And then yesterday I checked the amount of steps we made and it's like at 18,000 or something like that. So that's where the croissants go. We got a little basket over here and champagne and balloons is it my birthday this is battle the amount of detail i've never experienced something like this in my life oh look at us took a shower it's good the weather is a bit cold and i feel like I did not think about that part, which happens often when you focus about fashion and aesthetic rather than practicality. But we'll make it work. I also have this like stone, so let me just... <gasps> yeah. Every time I come to Paris, I realize how little I've seen. Although I lived here for three or four months, when I was modeling, I wasn't present enough to experience it, unfortunately. And I was too focused on running around trying to get jobs as a model because I had to pay this. And I always think to myself, I wish I could go back to those ages, like 16, 17, 18, when I started traveling and like spending time in Tokyo and Paris. And instead of focusing on all this, these things that were out of my control, I wish I actually got to be in that moment and enjoy it. And I guess that's like my biggest advice whenever I speak to anyone at those ages. Like don't rush to grow up. Really focus on being present and enjoy where you're at because things are gonna develop and happen either way. So at least make sure that you are, you know, actually there every step of the way. This fluffiness. Doesn't want to stay on. I don't know what to wear. Story of my life. We are shooting today and we arrived in this gorgeous area in Paris. It's more residential. We're shooting in an apartment. Apparently a really cool one. I'm excited. We had some like last minute adjustments uh, because we weren't prepared for like wardrobe wise, but we're gonna make it happen. So pretty. Welcome home. Hello. Wow, thank you. How are you? Very good, thank you. This is gorgeous. I think the idea is just to shoot you chilling with the product, maybe discovering textures and mm -hmm. you know, do some a bit of cropped pictures with some nice textures of cream on the on the cheek or things like that, but very, very simple. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take just 45 minutes with you for the pictures yeah. and then they're going to do a kind of a little film that will explain it better than... Um, okay, than perfect. Okay, we are shooting our first shot and they asked me for something pink and bright. So you can sit over there. Mm -hmm. We'll just do a few shots, check the makeup and the skin. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to see? Sure. <laughs> Have a look and tell me. Oh, that's a great color. Love it. I think the skin is really like natural, healthy, yeah. beautiful. That's I love it all. Okay, great. Operation. 
So we finished our we wrapped up day with a Belmont and now we're just going for dinner at Giraffe uh, restaurant which I really wanted to check out. There's also, we're literally in the center of it all. <laughs> One year old, my friend. It's all about being resourceful, okay? The reality. I didn't get here by accident. It's all about the resourcefulness. Why is there so many people here? What is there? What is this? Like a tourist trap or something? Oh my god, they're amazing. Okay, yeah, you're good. Woo. Good morning. Yesterday was a really, really cool day. I feel like I didn't get a chance to really dive into it a little bit. It was such a cool, surreal experience to shoot with Belmont in Paris. It was different and it was fun and it was exciting and it was like I improvised a lot and I love that. I love like flexing or working on muscles that are usually not worked on. So you already know that I'm like all about like put me in the most uncomfortable place and let me learn more about myself, you know? And then we had dinner at Giraffe, which was really, really nice. And then we came back, worked on some styling you guys saw. Today, we have a really fun day again. It's kind of like half day of shooting. Today, we're kind of doing like a day in the life, which is really fun. I'm having so much fun, my life's on my mind. You know what's so crazy with these trips when, you, when I get to do my kind of work away from the kids? It's like my time to really, really... Do I have boogers? 
It's like my time to really disconnect from that part of my life. And when I say disconnect, obviously I talk to the kids every day and you know, Gary sends me pictures and stuff like that. And I'm aware what's going on. Like I make an effort to really be present here. I am aware that I'm very lucky that I'm able to do that because I do feel that I have right now enough support at home. Nori came back to Miami for a few weeks until I'm back. So I'll be able to, you know, do this and work and focus on what I'm doing here and not worry about what's going on at home. So that's a big, big, big deal for me. Okay, I have to say this Hydra Tree eye cream is... And yesterday, because we were shooting, my skin was... Mwah! Kept like putting the creams on, showing how to use the product, talking about the product. It was amazing. Just need to plan out a few more things for uh, the days that we have a bit empty. Usually when I'm on a trip and there's like an empty free day, it's usually kind of like the organic or like the content day. Using everything that I have like clothes-wise that I haven't used and like I shoot content with it. Like a whole system over here. They are gonna have hair and makeup today on set, so I allowed myself to wash my hair because I did not want to deal with doing my hair. Mm, let's go eat. This is so nice. Healthy breakfast. The jams here are not like as sweet. It's 80% fruit and 20% sugar. I feel like it's the opposite on our side of the world. Wow, I like that. I feel like I haven't been filming my outfits. This is my outfit for today. And if you don't like it, too bad, I'm still wearing it. Okay, I'm late, yet again. I have to say that this trip, I'm late a lot. So I think it was more of the timing aspect that hasn't been working out for me, which I'm never late for work. Like this is not how I roll. Okay, oh, I'm sweating, I'm hot. Cold. I'm yes no. The doors here are so heavy. I always love, like, when I'm alone with the camera, it's literally just like, I just share everything that's going through my mind. And sometimes it's so chaotic and unnecessary, but it's part of why I love to do this, you know? I'm just like, Bleh. everything that's in there. Look at her. Then I look like I'm 12. I just want to share with you what's going on right now. I got all dressed and ready to get filmed and obviously the minute where it's full size shooting. You see, these are the cars you should have in Paris. <gasps> Look at this. Uh, wow, wow, wow. We're going the, to Cafe à la Crème. It's apparently a very well known cafe in Paris. This is actually kind of epic because the whole concept of this shoot is like Valeria in Paris. And they're taking us, Belmont is taking us to all the best spots. I love this for me. Turn around, yeah. It's perfect again and it's perfect. Yeah, now we're gonna put the skirt. Whoa! <laughs> Are you supposed to walk? Oh my god, this is strange. <laughs>
it across the line. I see what you're doing there. <laughs> you do it for the picture. <laughs> Give it to me. Like, what is life? Mm -hmm. Ready to give me face. Walk, walk, fashion. Okay. It looks really good. Fancy farms. I love it. Okay, so we are done a really amazing shoot day with Oman and now the team is taking us for a little surprise activity. We'll get there and I want to get all the tea, but I'm so excited. We are now walking to Place Van Damme where it's basically kind of like the jewelry district in Paris and it's so beautiful. Oh my god, and today is oh, the weather. Perfection. for you. Okay, amazing. Kobe is um, what we like to call the first sustainable jeweler from the Paris Place Vendôme. Mm. All around the Place Vendôme there are traditional jewelers and um, we've chosen to be sustainable mm -hmm. by not using standard uh, materials. Mm -hmm. We only use gold that is recycled from old device, electronic devices. Mm -hmm. Okay, and now we are going to learn a bit about the diamonds. I'm so excited. In North America, yeah. I feel like consumers are becoming more um, interested in transparency and mm -hmm. understanding the repercussions of yeah. everything that they consume. Very slowly, but it's happening. Mm -hmm. uh, so I do think that even from a place of ethical and just knowing that you're purchasing something that you know doesn't destroy a different part of the world. Yeah. Yes. All the oval diamonds will have this kind of bow tie. When we launched the brand, we've decided to create a, a collection that would be dedicated to commitment. Mm -hmm. And this Let's Commit collection, helping five organizations that are around the globe. So for sale of every bracelet, you don't 15%. 15%. Of the price of this bracelet will mm -hmm. go to the association that you choose. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is the project you would like to support? I would like to support the children. Yeah. Great. <laughs> right. yes. And there is something else that we would like to show you. Mm -hmm. And it's a collection that is for VLP. Very loved people. The idea is that you have the necklace with the diamond mm -hmm. and then the names of your very important mm -hmm. people around you. There's that is so sad. He should come first. He's my first one. Yeah. Then it's the others. <laughs> okay. We will, we will put them around the diamond. Oh, I love that. That would be amazing. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. This was really, really awesome. I loved yeah. learning so much more about it. I have a better understanding of where the world is heading to, right, in this industry. It's very nice. I love what you guys are doing. Thank you Thank very you. much. We are very <laughs> happy that we had you today. Yeah. Thank to you. be honest, all the girls here are mm -hmm. very jealous <laughs> of us <laughs> to meet you. Yes. <laughs> because oh, they're so all <laughs> and they're all telling you. Yeah. Hello, bonjour. Hello. Bonjour. Hello. 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 Exactly. Hello. 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 Hello to the hotel room. Um, it was such an awesome experience to learn more about the brand and get this beautiful bracelet and just like learn about the future of this industry of diamonds because I truly feel like it, this is where we're heading as we get better and more conscious of what's going on in the world and better ways to like consume things that we love. We'll get there on myself part of a very slow journey. Oh my God, ow. Oh. This is the best way to finish a long day, okay? Two long days. Do you think I know how to do this? You don't? Can it fly into my eye? <laughs> Unless you're pointing it in your <laughs> eye, I don't think so. 
No, but twist it. What are oh. you doing? That's what they're doing. Move it. No, you're gonna break oh the chandelier. God. The mirror. Everything is glass. Oh my god. This is so anticlimactic. Somebody's gonna call saying they heard a gunshot and <laughs> two women screaming. <laughs> Good morning, uh, Paris. Today is Friday. We did the most yesterday, and I think last night was the first night that I actually got like a solid sleep. Although I went to sleep really late, uh, today our day started later, treating us with their signature facial and I'm just so excited because my face been sleeping for a couple of days, you know? We are now heading to their uh, famous Vermont Spa in uh, La Maurice Hotel. So it's right here, I'm just putting pants on. And that's it, we're gonna be doing that. I have to brush my teeth because, yo, this is not it. The amount of bread and like wine I've been drinking, I'm so bloated. Granted, I also had just like three croissants this morning, so I don't even know. Like, there's no one to blame but myself. But you know, I'm living life, I'm enjoying my time, I'll worry about all that nonsense when I get back home. There's a, an exhibit of Thierry Mogler that was open, I think, a few months ago, and it's still running. And when they opened it, he was still alive. It's still running now, and obviously it has such a different significance now that he's gone. So I really, really, really want to see that as well. We're trying to make that work. And uh, yeah, today will be a little bit of just like more replenishing type of day. I was thinking about making like a content day today and tomorrow, but I have to say I'm a little spent. So I'm gonna scale it back a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna brush my teeth and then we're out. Mwah! Bonjour. So these are all the products that we're using? Yes. Ooh. And what is the treatment we're doing today? The treatment is called luminosity. It's Makes very sense. nice. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, you will see it's more of a, to have a glow on the skin. To mm -hmm. have, uh, if you want, like this time of the year after winter, this is the mm -hmm. best thing to have a glow on the skin. Mm -hmm. This is the collagen mask? Yes. Put it on the neck. Neck and the, oh, now I'm gonna put it on your face. Mm -hmm. Face here. That was so nice. She gave me like really nice back massage, like shoulders and neck. Oh, I feel revived. This collagen mask, it was like tingling, and I felt the magic is happening. Okay, I have to put my Excuse me, I have to put my uh, robe on so I can talk more after because right now <laughs> the foam was the bubble falls that is actually a um, known uh, product for them. Then there's these two masks, the Lumi mask, which I've been using lately, really great. The Lumi peel, this is I think their primary line and this is their new line, the Willuminosity. Then you have oh, the spray, Lumi Sense, Lumi Cream the eye and the prime neck one and it's all on me Celine got her first professional massage as she mentioned <laughs> did you enjoy it? it was so good Amarsana got the luminosity treatment did you enjoy so it? so good I feel like glowing we are glowing. We are going to the Terry Mugler show. I'm so excited to the exhibit. It's gonna be phenomenal. I see it.
Okay, so we just finished the Terry Mugler exhibit. It was hands down probably one of the best fashion designer exhibits I've ever seen. The man is just like an anomaly. So talented. It was like I still need to process it all. It was absolutely amazing. Why are you so close to me? We really need to learn how to use this camera. And now we are gonna walk for uh, to a spot we got recommended for some lunch. Let's go. I don't do it. It's very emotional. <laughs> I know. How many times did I tell you I'm crying? Okay, we're continuing our adventures. We stopped for a little snack. I got sardines. And a glass of wine. This is, by the way, a small glass of wine. He asked if we want the small or the big. I really want to see what the big is. Because this is almost my whole face. Gotta stay hydrated. My mom will be so happy that I'm eating all these healthy fats. <laughs> Glass and pears. 